the future leaders of the oil and gas industry are here at OTC to learn from the best. Geared towards young professionals, the ever popular Next Wave program offered insight on how unconventional and renewable resources will contribute to the energy mix and how it might impact the conventional's market. It's like a whole package that can help you to understand how we are moving towards. It says that we the Jones, we need to understand that no matter how small the job is, it's an opportunity. And the opportunity has to be taken, no matter what. Helge Halderson, OTC board member and Stat Oil North America's Vice President of Strategy, led the program as this year's keynote speaker. He shared his passion for the industry and what he believes young professionals need to be successful. So joining me now, Helge, inspiring speech for those young professionals. Why is it important for OTC to have this Next Wave program? You know, we, we totally depend on them. If you look at the world demand for energy going forward, from 2013 to 2050, we're going to need 100% more energy because the population goes from 7 to 9 billion. And then you have many old guys like me leaving the industry. So we are totally dependent on them, you know, to deliver the energy that the world needs. Panelists from around the world then dove into the changing factors of the industry and how these trends will impact young professionals. As you look at the young people interacting with us seasoned vets is really adaptability, curiosity, a willingness to learn and not move on too quickly and then pull that through your career and then how to communicate. You know, very important in today's electronic world for keeping the human element because that's where your networks are built. Panelists spoke about the challenges they faced throughout their careers, how their own experiences impacted where they are today, and also provided advice for young professionals on how to survive in the global market. What I found is that it's really important to spend the right amount of time on the technical aspects of your career. I spent a decade perfecting my craft as a technical professional, and I've spent the last 10 years in management roles, and I really talked to the, uh, the folks today about the importance of uh, building good, strong, credible backgrounds and good, strong, credible careers and good, strong, credible foundations on which you can build careers over the long term. I think that's what, that's what really has served me well over my career. I think it's interesting for them to see that there are people who are so passionate about this business that they've stayed in it their entire careers. They may change companies, they may change focus in what they're doing, but they don't leave the industry by and large because it, it, there are so many different opportunities and it's good for them to see many different ways of getting where they want to be. The Next Wave program also gave young professionals the opportunity to discuss and explore career development options with leaders in the industry. It was a, a great experience because honestly thinking back, I thought their parts would have been different to what something I would have wanted to do, but it's the same process like history repeats itself so it's like learning from their mistakes or learning from what they did and I could apply it to my life so it would be easier in achieving those goals. I think I did the best networking here that I'll do over the entire course of the conference. Um, I was able to ask my questions firsthand and then get them answered. The Next Wave program is the ideal event for young professionals to gain insight for the future of their careers and this year was no different. For OTC TV, I'm Carling Ponder.